ask you a question. Did you know Ben Rich? No, but I talked to people who did. Now, I'll tell you what Ben Rich had to do with this. First of all, do you know where he was born? Ben Rich was one of the most classy, one of the, the, the biggest Mossad spy in the United States. I mean, he got the most classified information. Here's what happened. Here's how he got messed up with Israel. In 1947, when Israel became a state, um, uh, Jim, um, uh, I keep saying Anslinger, it's not Anslinger, James uh, Angleton was <laughs> chief of uh, CIA in, right. uh, in Rome. Okay, they sent Angleton down to Tel Aviv along with some guys at MI6 to form Assad. And for some reason, whoever, however it happened, uh, James Angleton got allied with M, uh, with Mossad like this forever. He was the mole. If you remember in 1960, he was the head CIA director of foreign intelligence and he was the guy that always was looking for the Russian mole. He was the Russian mole because, you know, he was so friends with Mossad, he'd tell Mossad stuff and Mossad would pass it on to Russia. So when um, uh, David Ben Gurion in the summer of uh, 1963 said, uh, you know, we have to kill Kennedy. We, we have to. I'm tired of you threatening us with uh, inspecting Demona. It's none of his friggin' business. I don't want to hear any more from Kennedy. You kill him. He gave that. He gave that order to Mossad and then resigned, so that even he couldn't be held responsible for it. Mossad then went to Angleton. Uh, the Kennedy assassination was not a CIA job, but it was greased by the CIA only because Angleton was in there with his buddies at Mossad. And he's the one that greased the skids for everything that happened in Dealey Plaza and the escape and everything. They were uh, Corsican sharpshooters there, hired by Mossad. Uh, they pulled off the whole thing and everybody says, well, you know, they think the mob killed Kennedy or maybe Johnson did or, you know, the, you know, Castro. It wasn't. It was Israel. And the reason they did is because David Mungarian didn't want any more inspections of Demona. And that's all. And the that's their, their nuclear, it's where they do their nuclear that's where they biological the nuclear bombs with, with plutonium they stole from us uh -huh. and uh, and other but things. what's Ben Rich got to do with that okay so Ben Rich was uh, born with a very wealthy Jewish family in the Philippines and uh, very highly educated and he was slipped into Lockheed in 1953 as a uh, 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 as um, Kelly Johnson's uh, second in charge <clears throat> And he was there for the development of the U-2, and he was there for uh, the development of um, uh, stealth. You know, that, the, there are a lot of Ben Rich famous kind of UFO quotes that kind of allude to things that, technology, right? Right. Yeah, there's nothing of that in that book. That book's the inside story of the development of the U-2. I understand. Um, and the SR-71. But he, he did say, he, he said, that, what's the exact quote? You probably remember it. Um, we have stuff that would make uh, George Lucas jealous. Would, that would make we could take E.T. home. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so, I mean, he was he was an insider from way back, is what you're telling me. Right? Yeah, but he was a my side spy, I'm going to tell you how they did it. Okay, now, but so... But on some level, if he's a Mossad spy, because the Mossad seems to be in cahoots with if you want to call them, you know, the Nazi, NASA Nazi group. I'm glad you understand that, because when people say, did Israel have anything to do with 9-11, I said, as much as Santa Claus had to do with Christmas. <laughs> so anyway. So yeah, they're all working together. If you're telling me Angleton was, was involved with Mossad, you're telling me Ben Rich is involved with Mossad, you know, we've got... We've got the whole, there's the, there's a whole alignment there. Absolutely, positively, beyond a shadow of a doubt. So, now we get ready to uh, to build the stealth fighter, and uh, what, this was the beginning of the real secret stuff that went on within our government. Uh, the name...